the 22nd of January at San Jose, in which he allowed just one goal, Tyson Nash, in the win. And the Coyotes with a great opportunity here tonight. As the puck will be thrown to the front, and it's underneath Vomelka, and they scramble for it. As this one will be popped back to center ice where Victor Hedman will control. Yep. They get that puck in deep, and everything for Tampa goes to the front of the net. You look at all the bodies, and that's where you got to knock somebody down. You can't allow a second or third opportunity. Not with this talent. And you don't get a second. A real good challenge here for the Coyotes. No doubt the big bad Tampa Bay Lightning in the house. And this is a great measuring stick for this group. Hedman has it. He brings it right back in. And Vamelka the save. And we'll get a whistle. That one fires off the post. A chance in front. Palat. And knocked away. Dyson Mayo. But he can't get it out. That's where the Coyotes are going to want to play. We saw a lot of that in that game against Seattle. Just simple hockey, getting in, in deep, and establishing that forecheck. Chance here over the line. Erickson with a shot, and Elliott the save. Now it's moved right back. Stamkos trying to get around Chikrin. Stamkos with a backhander, and that goes through the crease. Anyone else, and Stamkos, I think, has a, a breakaway in that situation. They have so many guys that can fill the back of the net. You can't give them any easy opportunities. Brought along and now brought out by Braden Point. And he'll bring it back to the Coyotes line with a shot and a goal. And he beats Vamelka low glove and it's 1-0 Tampa Bay. But look at how easy he makes it. Speed to the neutral zone. He gets the defenseman moving, uses the defenseman as a screen, and then shoots back against the grain. And puts that in the perfect spot just over the pad below the glove. Well, Hedman has it. Brought along. Point's got it. Little drop, Hedman towards the net. That was denied. Rebound, Palato, and he can't get a backhander past Vanelka. Palat. Kept by Mayo. Set one towards the net. Steered away by Elliott. Strawman. Towards the net. That's a lot of the corner. Here's a chance. Galchenyuk off the bar. A great opportunity there. And now a turnover. Boy brings it in. Patties look to go. Boyd, he shoots, a stop by Elliott, rebound, side of the net, they can't put it home! Oh, right there was Keller, the horn went and everything, but I don't think it was all the way across the line. Remember the Tampa Bay Lightning until, oh, about six weeks ago when the Coyotes claimed them off waivers. Maroon, right back to the front, trying to track it, and it goes inside of the net, I think that's Corey Perry's goal. It snuck in behind Vamelka, and it's 2-0 Lightning. Up the net, a little bit of a broken play on the zone entry, and they just throw pucks at people in front of the net. And yes, absolutely, that's Corey Perry. Here's the, the play, just funnels it to the net. You know Perry's going to go to the front. And he just banks it right off, I believe, the pad of Vamelka as he tries to close off that short side post. There's the initial save, and then the rebound. Galchenyuk gets it. Under a minute to go in this opening period. Keller to the line, quick shot, Moser, rebound, they score! Alex Galchenyuk, a backhand beauty, it's 2-1. Gonna get this up high, right here, screen, right here, and it goes right to the front of the net. And look at the big, juicy rebound by Elliott, and who's there? Galchenyuk, right there on the doorstep, and he buries another one. Goals in back-to-back -back games for him, and it's a big one, and it gets his build. 29 goals against this group and 13 this year. What a season Corey Perry has had. Playing in his 1,142nd NHL game tonight. And out of the zone go to Lightning. Here they come. Quick up for Maroon. Maroon, he hits the trailer. Sergachev with a shot and a stop by Vamelka. The ice. You look at the Coyotes, they got numbers, but two guys go to one. Nobody picks up the most dangerous guy, and that's the guy in the slot, Sergachev, and he lets one fly. Big save there by Vamelka, who reads this play, comes out. Nobody's screening him in front. Coyotes have ten shots through two, Tyson. That's not enough. They need to put some pucks on net here in the third. Yeah, not enough against this team, that's for certain. You got to play in the offensive zone. They have the fresh legs, though. Hedman coughed it up. Schmaltz has got it. You now Schmaltz out high. Lost it to Kalorn. And turned the other way. Stamkos races back. Stamkos, Rashadi scores. 
Steven Stamkos. Oh, he looked off the winger, Tyson. And fires a dart over the shoulder of Amelka. It's 3-1. He's shocked on this Tampa Bay Lightning team. And there's a turnover by Smaltz. And these come back to haunt you when you have guys like... Steven Stamkos firing the pill. Look at this shot. Pulls it in, lets it go. Short side shelf. Bar down and no chance for Vomelka. And maybe he uses Jacob Chicken a little bit as a screen. Just gets it off so quick. Oh, there's a redirection in front. That's a big block by Mayo. And Mayo leads the Coyotes in blocks. Here's Schmaltz to the front. Keller! Oh, what a setup! And Elliott slides to make the save. What a setup is right. Over on that Stamkos goal and gets it here, ready to screen. Zips it right across. And that's a lot of real estate for Brian Elliott to cover with this pass east to west. And I think Clayton Keller just kind of put it right back into him. Didn't put it where he wanted to. Short side shelf. Here's Keller. Keller dancing. Keller to the front. Oh, and he, I think that rang off the bar. As this one bounces in front, it just goes wide. Right off the pipe is right. Runs out of real. Maroon to the line, Sergachev, bouncing around in front, Perry, and he can't get it home. Oh, he just lifted the stick of Mayo. Same play like he had in the first period. And that's the play, and those are the, the deep. The 14 shots isn't going to get it done. Yeah, won't do that. They've got four here in the third period of play. They've had some good looks. There's Ruda. Now Boyd will take it away. Here's a good look. Keller is in. He shoots. He scores. Clayton Keller. One goal game again. Like most nights, but what a play by Boyd. And Clayton Keller comes rumbling down that left side. A little off-speed shot. Doesn't wind up with a big ripper. But that off-speed, that hesitation, that subtle hesitation by Keller right here. And that gets... Elliott to bite a little bit, then he puts it right through the five hole. What a goal. At the center it goes. Ruda. Here's a chance. Stamkos down the middle. He scores. Steven Stamkos on what was pretty much a broken play. And it's 4-2 Tampa Bay. Anticipation. Right place, right time. A little bit lucky there. That was a beautiful oh, play yeah. by Joseph. Yeah, no broken play. My apologies. Yeah, oh my, was that ever a little sassy redirection. One tapper to Stamco. Fast to spare. A lot of passing, not a lot of shooting right now. Keller to the middle. Chick ready. Fire one just wide. I give Tampa a lot of credit. They're right in those shooting lanes. Back out high. Goss to spare. For Schmaltz. To the middle, Chikrin, and that was blocked. Smoltz follows it up, he scores! Nick Smoltz! And back to a one-goal game! One-goal game, you gotta shoot the puck. The Coyotes do a beautiful pass to Chikrin, he gets it on net, and Smoltz just follows it up. But look at the bodies in front, hacking and whacking. And Christian Fisher, I'm not sure if he meant to pass this or not. Doesn't matter. He went to shoot that puck. And next ball, he makes no mistake. He puts that. Moved along by Chikrin, six to go. Bouncing puck is in. And a clear by Tampa. And they will survive tonight in the desert.